Hi, my name is Cliff Mountner from Cliff Mountner Photography. I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about tips in uh, learning who your photographer should be, finding out a little bit about them, and uh, finding the best fit for your wedding day. One of the things that's happening out there is there's a lot of choices. There's a lot of very good photographers. There's also a lot of photographers that are just getting into it. Find their blog. Take a look at a photographer's blog, which is really a window into their souls. You can find out the level of work they're producing, and also, more importantly, the level of consistency in a photographer's work right through the blog. You can see if that style is for you, or you can see if that style contrasts to what you're looking for. Those are great ways to start. One of the great things about getting married in Philadelphia are the phenomenal urban scapes that Philadelphia has. The other thing that's very underrated is the light that we have. We don't have these enormous skyscrapers like New York and LA and other cities. We've got light all different times of the day. Talk to your photographer about your desires to take photographs uh, in the various parts of our city and then he'll devise a plan or she'll devise a plan that will take you to these various points. Uh, whether it's off the beaten track uh, sometimes I'll take my brides in, under an overpass or some, some rather uh, interesting uh, areas of, of the city. Others might be a little bit more traditional, maybe the Second Bank of the United States or just Rittenhouse Square or Washington Square Park. It depends upon if that bride has an edge to them or if they're a little bit more traditional in nature. Talk to your photographer, communicate with them, and accomplish this through a plan. Thank you so much for listening. I hope some of these tips help you. And just remember, photographers, we're only as good as our clients. Help them 